Hey everybody, welcome back to Tech Odyssey. So I'm back again with one of my most favorite cases of all time, the Rinky Fusion case for the Google Pixel 3a XL, also available for the 3a. So it comes in four different colors. It comes in clear, it comes in smoke black, which I don't have depicted here, but it also comes in aqua blue, and then it comes in their brand new camo black. So you have four different color options to choose from. You can pick them up $13.99 from rinkystore.com. So, one of the great things about this case is it holds up so well. It's got mill standard drop protection. It has the quick catch where you can just put a wrist strap through the lanyard loop. The squeeze function still works. And then it has great reinforced bumpers and of course some of the best buttons in the business. So I keep coming back to this case over and over because one, it's not very expensive, $13.99. You can find them on sale all the time. Uh, this one take a little bit longer to come out than most of the other products, but it's here now for the Pixel 3a series and 3a XL which I'm super happy about now one thing with these cases I want to demonstrate here it has a film on on the outside and the inside except for the camel one it doesn't have one on the outside but on the inside uh, it might take a little bit sometimes they're a little pain in the rear to get out but just uh, pull those out and then you're ready to go and put your phone in the case now they fit snugly they've got a great fit on them solid cutouts easy access to get to your fingerprint sensor, to get to your speaker on the bottom, USB-C port, the camera, all of that good stuff. Now you'll see here, it fits very snugly. Uh, it holds onto the phone, so you're not gonna have to worry about your phone popping out of the case, which is really nice, and it looks fantastic. And regardless of the model that you get, you can still see the underlying color, which is really important. So you can see nice precise cutouts there. It's very shallow, so you can plug in uh, your, your cable with no issue. There's a little lanyard loop. You may even be able to get an adapter in there um, if you need to use one. The buttons are nice, have great tactile feedback and they're responsive. And then you got the recessed cutout protection on the back there as well. So another cool thing, if you get the, uh, the clear one, you can see everything, including the colored button. But in addition to that, if you get the other colors as well, the back is still that clear polycarbonate so you can see whatever color you got. And then the sides or the bumpers, they're uh, translucent so you can see through them as well. So overall, it looks great, it works great. And here's an illustration with the blue one so you can get an up close look at it. And they have a raised edge protective lip all the way around it which protects the screen. So in the event that you wanna place it down on a flat surface or if you drop it, the first thing that's gonna come in contact with the surface is going to be the case and not your phone screen. I, I don't even have a screen protector on here right now. I'm actually using a liquid screen protector. So they offer, like I said, the mill standard drop protection rating, which is up to four feet that they have tested it at. And then you still get the squeeze function for the active edge feature on the sides as well. So you're not losing any of the functionality for the case. So overall, it's a great case. And as illustrated here, I did drop it, uh, not from four feet, I couldn't really capture that with my camera, but this is the first time I've ever actually dropped one of my phones with a case in it purposefully, and you can see that it's perfectly all right. So that's all I've got on the Rinky Fusion case for the Google Pixel 3a XL and also the 3a. It's a wonderful case. Check them out, rinkystore.com. It should be available on Amazon shortly. They do have the link, but not all the colors are there at the moment as of today, but that's all I've got. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down in the comment section. I'll get back with you. As always, thanks for tuning in and for your continued support, and I'll see you guys next time.